Of all the great civilizations of antiquity, Egypt remains one that is still shrouded in mystery. Even though thousands of passionate intellectuals have dedicated their lives to studying ancient Egypt, there is still so much that is unknown. If what the experts say is true, then civilized life in Egypt could go as far back as 6,000 before the Common Era. Even by the times of Alexander the Great or Julius Caesar, people who are now considered ancient people. Egypt was a civilization that evoked a feeling of deep mystery and intrigue. Disappearance of Queen Nefertiti Queen Nefertiti was one of the most powerful women throughout ancient Egyptian history. She ruled at perhaps the height of Egyptian power during the 18th dynasty from 1370 before Common Era to 1330 before Common Era. Her husband Pharaoh Akhenaten was father to none other than King Tutankhamun, aka King Tut. A surprising amount is known about Queen Nefertiti thanks to a series of outstanding archaeological finds from the early 20th century. In 1912, a near-perfect bust of Nefertiti was found and she quickly became one of the most famous icons of Egyptian history. Despite her elevated status, they never found her final resting place. Never finding her tomb has raised many questions among skeptics about how important she might have been at the time, but all of this is pure speculation. The Mysterious Land of Punt The ancient Egyptians came into contact with many foreign cultural groups throughout their history, but none remain as mysterious and shadowy as the people of Punt. There are dozens of written records about the area they call Punt, but few clear details on where it might have been. Punt is often depicted as a powerful African kingdom that existed alongside the Egyptians somewhere in the south. The Egyptians clearly respected and even venerated this kingdom so far as to call it God's land. The people who lived in Punt did not keep any known records of themselves. All that is known about Punt comes from the Egyptians themselves. The best evidence available that might reveal the true location of Punt is a few mummified baboons found in an ancient tomb in Egypt. Scientists have traced the origins of these baboons to what is modern day Ethiopia. Labyrinth of Giza. As amazing as the great pyramids of Egypt are, some experts believe there was much more to the surrounding area than just the pyramids themselves. There is a decent amount of archaeological and historical evidence that would suggest there was once a vast labyrinth that stretched out near the pyramids. The Greek historian and geographer Herodotus mentioned a massive labyrinth by the pyramids in the 4th century before Carmen Tre when he visited Egypt. In modern times, no such labyrinth is visible and many believe his writings to be either a lie or done so out of confusion. However, in, in 2008, a structure buried under mountains of sand near the Great Pyramids was detected by geo-radar scans. They discovered a massive stone foundation that measured nearly 1,000 feet across. There has been no attempt to dig down and uncover this mysterious structure, but that could soon change in the future. Hidden Chamber at Giza As famous as the Great Pyramids are, there is still much that humans do not know about them. Large areas of the pyramids have been extensively explored and studied, but some areas of the pyramids remain untouched by modern archaeologists and scientists. In, in 2017, researchers scanned the largest pyramid, Khufu, and their findings were nothing short of amazing. In addition to the three chambers discovered in previous years, there was a much larger hidden chamber sitting at the bottom of the pyramid, the chamber has no pathways or known entrances to it. How or why the Egyptians would have made this addition to the pyramid is still a total and complete mystery. What lies inside this chamber and what its purpose was will likely remain unknown. The Dendera Light The Dendera Light refers to a puzzling inscription carved into the walls of a temple dedicated to the Egyptian god Hathor. The image appears to depict either the use or instructions on how to create a crook's tube an object used as a light bulb in the 19th century. Skeptics are quick to dismiss these claims as misinterpreted readings of what is a religious ceremony, while others see this as evidence that the Egyptians, along with other ancient people of the era, figured out some primitive form of electricity. Humans might never know the full truth, 
but it is certain that this particular engraving will remain the focal point of many theories for decades to come. I hope you found the video interesting. If you liked it, don't forget to subscribe. Goodbye.